Girl, where am I going in this? I look like I'm about to wrestle you to the ground. Welcome to this week's weekly vlog. Today, well right now we're at Target. We're about to pick up a lamp because I told y'all in the last vlog, we don't have a lamp. Our lamp, girl, it is broke. He broke it. My husband broke the lamp. So we have to get a new lamp today and we're just out enjoying the day. It's really, really nice out. But before we get into what we're gonna be doing today, I need to go ahead and get into this hair. Y'all see this hair? So this wig is from Mega Look Hair, and I wanna say thank you to Mega Look Hair for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. I'm gonna go ahead and get into how I applied this wig, what this wig looks like out of the box, all that type of stuff quickly, and then we can get on with our day. We can run into Target. So let's go ahead and get into this hair, and then I'll see y'all inside. So your wig is gonna come in the Mega Look packaging, and of course in that packaging you receive your wig as well as other gifts. But this is the wig, that's what it looks like when it came out of the box. Of course this wig is a 18 inch water wave 13 by six lace frontal highlight wig. It comes with three combs inside and adjustable straps inserted inside of the wig. So if you're interested in this wig, I'll leave a link for it down below. I also will leave a coupon code down in the description box as well in case you're interested. So. Let's go ahead and get into it so we can get into Target Girl. So I'll go ahead and leave all that information down below. So we're headed into Target to go get this lamp. Is there anything else? We need toilet paper. Okay. Yeah. So hopefully we can find one that we like. We're not looking for something that's really like permanent because hopefully we'll be moving soon or something. So this lamp just gotta be cute enough so we can put our little light in it. Yeah. <laughs> that's it. You look handsome. Hmm? You look handsome. Thank you. We got it. So we're at Lagarde. We just left Target. We're gonna grab something to eat. Y'all know we're having lunch at 6:11. But either way, we're having lunch. But we're at a what area is this in? It's like Brookhaven. 
that little workout yesterday got my hips and legs all sore but so we're headed into Lagarde it's like a Louisiana sort of bistro I don't think it's a bistro I just made that up it's like a restaurant I don't know we've been here a couple times before they have really good deviled eggs I think hush puppies all that type of stuff so hungry can't wait to get inside and eat yeah I'm finally hungry I was full all day <laughs> Hey y'all, we're back home from Lagarde. So we're back home and um, Lagarde was good, but I got a few Amazon packages and we got this, I gotta put together this, um, oh girl, what did I just do? I gotta put together the lamp. Hopefully it looks nice in here. I got these. We just need a lamp so we can have a smart moment that one. Yeah. And then we relax. Chilling. That office is a mess. If you saw the last vlog, then we had the smart. We got these smart bulbs from Costco, where you can control um, the lights in your home just from your phone or from your Alexa or whatever. So um, we're gonna be able to put it in there, and then you don't have to get up to turn on the lights. It's like a small thing, but it's an annoying thing to do. But I got these earrings from Amazon. To these cords. These are um, charging cords. Why are they so thick? No, for your phone and your car. Look how thick those cords are. But it's for the car and one for travel that we can keep. Okay. House shoes. I got mine. Nice. Just got my husband some new house shoes. We just, we always go through, well, we go through house shoes and like, Three, when now? Six months? Yeah, it's Yeah. Oh, mine look comfortable. This is like, I forgot what brand this is. I'll leave this one down below, but these are the house shoes. I always be thinking I want to get the aesthetic, like, oh, they look cute, but the, I want the ones that are comfortable. So, I wear a size five, well, no, six. I was supposed to say five. This is a size five, six, so. Then I need to get up out these clothes. The outfit I was wearing today, I really didn't like. I just put on whatever. I'm just ready to change my wardrobe. Oh, speaking of that, I got like a, this is an airport outfit. What is that? Why'd you buy an airport outfit? Because I like to have like, or something that you can just throw on. This is um, a dupe for the Aritzia one piece bodysuit. I looked it up. I don't know how much it costs, but I went on Aritzia's website and I was looking for something like this. And it was, I want to say like 70. And I think this one was only like 30. It feels like it has good fabric. Oh, this is nice. But this is what it looks like. I'm gonna try it on probably a little bit later because not right now. But it's just like a good, comfortable, like I need to throw on and go sort of outfit, especially for like leaving, going to the airport and leaving from your destination, all this stuff. So next we have to put together this lamp, but first we're gonna relax for a second and then are we going to the movies? Uh, oh, that's a lot of work. We got this uh, trunk thing. I'm not opening it now, but we got this trunk organizer because in the back of the of my new car, it's like just big. It's just everything's like f flopping around uh, because it's an SUV. So we got that, and I got my husband this clip for his car and for when we travel like a little phone clip. I hate the phone clips that you gotta like grab your phone onto. It's annoying. And I think that's everything. And I got some more stuff coming, I think tomorrow. Let me get up out of these clothes. I like this top. This top is from um, Nordstrom Rack, but I just don't like how I wore it. I just didn't know what to wear. I can't wear it, whatever. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't even wanna get into it. See y'all in a second, I'm gonna get changed. And I'll be showering a little bit later, but right now I just want to relax for a second. So I'll see y'all in a second. 
Making my cocktail. It's a cocktail. We need a shaker though. Yeah, we've been supposed to have a shaker. I don't even know what I'm doing. So I have my um, tequila with apple juice because it's like a really, it's a light non-acidic alcohol. Yeah. Okay, so this is a lamp that we got from Target. It's the one that I told, I don't know if I told y'all about this one, but this is the one I saw. It was the last one left. It was in the same spot like a couple days ago. So we're about to put it together now because we're about to watch John Wick and relax. Got some drinks going. Big. Yeah, well, we're Yeah. 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 Lighting right? Barely. <laughs> All day I had to go buy a SD card because I left mine at home. But I got a new one and I'm headed into um what do you call this? Home goods because I need to get some soap dispensers for the house. Let's see if they have any. I just need two. Just soap dispensers because the soap dispenser in our um, kitchen broke. So I don't want um, So we've been using dishwashing liquid. <laughs> it's just a mess trap, so. Let's see if I can find, and I need to find matching ones. So. Just a soap dispenser. If I can find the same type, that would be great, but do they have one for, let's see. Put some guys over here. Just give me a soap dispenser, just anyone. I think these are bathroom. I need one for the kitchen, because this is all the bathroom stuff. And I wonder if they have like kitchen soap. Dispensive. I think this is where. Yeah. At this point, give me anything. I just don't. I can't figure it out. It's blowing, but I'm going into five below to see if they have like under cabinet lights. Like I don't even. I haven't found like, anything today. Hello, how are you? Hey y'all, I am back in the car and I couldn't find anything I was looking for. And I actually found the under cabinet lights that I was looking for. But I was at five below every like light, like either every puck light or every um strip light was five dollars and fifty-five cents. I said, girl, <laughs> no ma'am, because I need like lights for every level of that shelf that I have. Girl, I'm better off getting it off Amazon because if it don't work, I can send it back. You know? Here, I don't know, like, if you can take it back or if I would want to. I don't know. But it's, like, really, really cheap looking. So, I decided not to get them. I couldn't find my face wash because they were all sold out. I used Thayer's Witch Hazel face wash. And I couldn't find any um, soap dispensers because they're for the, um, my soap dispensers are for the kitchen y'all can't even see me my soap dispensers are for the kitchen and they need to be labeled like dish 
in hand. So, so. Couldn't find that either, girl. I was just failing left and right. But that's okay. It's a really, really nice day. And I haven't been outside. So, um, I enjoy being outside. So, but now I'm about to go home. Relax. Chill. Eat lunch at 7 o'clock and that'll be it for the day for me now what am i supposed to be doing i think i'm supposed to be prepping to film tomorrow and i need to find a wig an amazon wig to review i've been trying to do my research on what type of wig i want to do so i actually want a wig that i can travel with but i guess i'll see i don't know um what else was i gonna say oh girl the car done picked up girl i really do much of nothing this week my schedule is basically clear so i get to like kind of relax i'm supposed to go to the beauty supply store but i think i'll do that tomorrow because it's too much i'm not trying to do too much in the day once i drive around like a couple times i'm like no ma'am i don't want to do this no more I am supposed to stop by one more Target to see if I can find my facial wash because I need that facial wash. It's been helping with these scars on my face. So, I don't know. I may have to go back out. I'm not sure. I think I have a little bit of soap left to wash my face tonight. But I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow. So, I got to find a place to find Thayer's Witch Hazel find a place to find Thayer's Witch Hazel with aloe facial wash like I <laughs> and it's all sold out because people love this stuff I know it's good but girl leave me some and it's been sold out at Target for a long time so I need to see if this other Target has it I think it says it has one or two so I may just swing by and get that but it's really frustrating and annoying you gotta be honest with you but I think I may go by tomorrow if I have enough for tonight to wash my face because I wash my face sometimes twice a day uh just to get rid of these whatever the heck these things are you can barely see them though now they're like going away but still over it oh and it's ha juneteenth happy juneteenth to my peoples celebrating the juneteenth of it all you know uh, we're not really doing anything. I'm not drinking today because we only drink on the weekends, as y'all know. And lately, I've been doing so good, baby. I love a good cocktail, but I have one or two. That's it, baby. I was good for three or four on a weekend. <laughs> Anyways, I guess I'll see y'all. I'm gonna run to the other Target. Y'all know I can't. Um, I can't vlog in Target. I'm gonna run to the other Target and see if they have this facial wash. And if they don't, girl, I'm just gonna mosey it on back home. So I guess I'll see y'all in a couple. Well, I'll see y'all in a second, but I'll see y'all in a couple of hours. Who you pull, girl? Don't pull out like that. I don't like that. Hey y'all, I haven't been able to vlog all day because I did this. Y'all see this? <laughs> I did this to my hair now. This is a wig review. I will be, I think it'll be up, what day? But we're not gonna get into this wig. I need to get into some clothes I just bought. So I just ate, I don't even know why I just ate. Why I ate before um, doing the clothing haul, but I bought some stuff from J Lux Lima. Boston stuff with J Lux label, and I want to try it on. And I also have um, like two other item, items I want to try on. Like, where'd they go? I don't know where I put them. I should put on some lip gloss, but girl, I just ate. I had like some fake ramen noodles with what else did I have? Chicken. It was good. I call them fake ramen noodles because it was like gluten free. Mmm. What do I do with that um, bodysuit? What do I do with it? But we're about to try on these clothes real quick. And then I need to close out the vlog. Girl, let me go find what I'm looking for real quick. Y'all don't look at my hairs on my chinny chin chin, hey. Okay y'all, so I'm gonna start with the Amazon stuff. I'm gonna start with the Amazon stuff and then I'm gonna move into the, um, what do you call it? The uh, stuff from J-Lux label. 
So y'all know I'm trying to revamp my closet. I ain't gave nothing away, but I'm still trying to revamp in my head. So let's start with the Amazon stuff first. Okay y'all, so this is the first thing. I got this from Amazon. This is like a Aritzia dupe. I saw this on the Aritzia website and it's like a really, I need better lighting. It's like a really thick cotton. Okay, so this is the first one. It's like a, it's like a yoga pant, bell bottom sort of pant. I wanted to wear this like casual days. This could be a good airport fit, like super cute. And it's like really, uh, what do you call it? Um, what do you call this? It's like really like constricting, like it sucks you in and it's like comfortable. Like it sucks you in and it's not that cheap like spandexy, I don't know what that material is, but it's like so cute. I like love this and it's really comfortable. I feel like a ballerina though. Look at myself in this mirror. But I would wear it like, just like this on a day out or with a cardigan. It's just like comfortable. I love one pieces to throw on and go. Cause girl, I don't even know what my fashion is no more. I don't know how to match, <laughs> so. Baby, I'll be struggling out here. So this is the first Amazon fit and I love it. I love it. I love it. I think it's cute, has seams, and it's like, I feel like this is like a perfect Aritzia dupe. So round number two. Girl, where am I wear this? Girl, where am I going? Girl, where am I going in this? I look like I'm about to wrestle you to the ground. But this is what this is looking like, this is like a one piece from Amazon. I forgot how much I paid for it, but I saw Raven Elise get this and I feel like I would just wear this to work out. This is like a good workout fit because I can't see myself wearing this to like do anything. I got it in the gray color. I like the gray, like neutral color, but I feel like it's cute and it's really like a soft, like spandexy sort of like shapewear. And it has a built-in bra, so it's really nice. I like this. What does it look like on the back? What does it look like right there? But girl, this sucking in is killing me. When I suck in, I squeeze in my booty, so it's just be looking like. <laughs> I don't know, what do you think? I mean, I think it's cute. It's whatever. It's an Amazon like set. It's an Amazon thing, so I like it. After the J looks label stuff, I'm super excited. Okay, so this first, this top, I didn't put it on right, but I don't want the neckline up here and I don't want my city falling out. <laughs> but I don't know how I feel about the top, but the pants and the pants are like a linen material and they're so cute. They're like a wide leg. They're, they have, they feel, the only thing about linen is that it feels like it's wet sometimes, like a thick, Linen, I don't know how to describe it, but I, the fabric is kind of annoying feeling to me. Like it feels like gauze on my legs, but I really do like this set because I saw it on the model and I was like, I want both. Like with this top, I'll have to pull it up. It's gonna be a little bit of boobage out, um, but I have small. Y'all know I'm small with the top, so. But I like these pants. Like I like the design of them and I feel like they'll be cute. And I think I like it. It's a little bit different though. And the waistline, I have to be careful with the late waistline on my pants because of my acid reflux, girl. I have to be careful, so I like, I like it. Like, what do y'all think? I don't know. What do y'all think? I feel like it's giving, girl, I don't like it when top, tops tie all over the place. Like that's really annoying to me. But these are real pockets in the back. I really like these pants. I feel like they're perfect for summer because they're they're thick, but they're linen. So it's like a different sort of material, but I don't know. Do I have any more pants? No, I don't. So this outfit is so cute. I don't know how I feel about my boobs. I'm a little, not wouldn't say subconscious, but my boobs, you know, I just wish they were a little bit bigger, but with the braids, this is actually really cute. Now my braids are a mess, but this set, can you see it? I feel like the lighting is not giving what it's supposed to have. Like, look, like it's like a crochet sort of material and it's supposed to like 
be like this. I think like put a necklace or something like that. This is cute. So there's a skirt. There's a long like max skirt. You know how J-Lux label loves. Girl, they love to give you a skirt down for the uncle. So cute. And it has this top that has like the little buttons on it. I feel like this is a good like nighttime outfit. And this is what it looks like in the back. I have to be careful because these braids are catching on everything. Probably should have took this wig off. But it's like this really cute like crochet material. This is a full set. I think it was like a hundred and something. But how I figure is that I, so I could also wear this outfit as separate. So I could wear the sweater. Like I can wear this sweater if I wanted to. Now it's supposed to be to the side, titty out. I could wear this sweater if I wanted to. I could wear the skirt if I wanted to. I could wear this top, like this top. It's like a bathing suit top. Like you can wear it in so many different ways. It's like three pieces in one. So I was like, you know what? This is, this is like a good investment because I can like separate this stuff and wear it in different ways. So I think it's really cute. Adorbs, right? And like really fashionable. Like I'm not that girl. I feel like, but I feel like I'm a girl. You know what I'm saying? This is like a look, right? With a cute little bag. Right here, I can't really show you because it's like, I don't have the uh, bottoms on, but it's a cute like ribbed bodysuit. It's super soft, like really soft. I got it in black. I really wanted to get it in white, but I was like, ah, I don't have a black, like a true black bodysuit. So I just needed to get one. And it's like buttery soft, like buttery, buttery, buttery soft. I love it. I love it. And I, of course I probably will wear it without a bra, but I just have a bra on because I don't want y'all to see nothing. Last dress, I was a little bit apprehensive about just trying on this one because, ooh, the bloatation, but look at this dress. It's like a, just a t-shirt dress, the same material as the last thing that I tried on. And it's like really soft. I just feel like it's a good, comfortable throw on dress. Everything I got is throw on, but you can dress this up, dress it down. I like it. And it's it goes all the way down, all the way down. Y'all know how J-Lo's label is. It gives the girl conservative, sexy, tight, and long. Why do I have to eat? I see why the girls don't eat before they try on hauls because sucking it is a lot, but. I feel like this is cute, right? Really cute, like neutral can toss it on and go, go to lunch, go to brunch, whatever. I love this. I love it, I love it, I love it. So, yeah, it's like this really nice rib material, but that's everything. Let me pop back on my clothes because, or like my pajamas, I need to take a shower and stuff, but I'm gonna throw on some pajamas because I have to make dinner now. So, y'all let me know what your favorite item was. I think it was like the black set. I also got, um, I didn't tell y'all. I I didn't mean to, I didn't know I did this, or at least I think I did. I got this, um, that same like tie up top in white. So, girl, basically I got it in the same color twice. But I guess I can wear it with different things, you know? So, it's a cute top. I just didn't want to buy it twice, but it's not enough for me to send it back. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll keep it in the packaging, I'm not sure. But this hair, it's tangling like crazy. Like the hair is everywhere. Oh my God. This is so soft. That's the sucking I need to do. I'll be doing this. I need sucking like this. But I look like I can't breathe. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and throw the veggies in the oven because finished my try on haul and I still need to take a shower this is old PJ's shower I just need to get on clothes child I'm like I'm exhausted I am so tired and this hair is about to take me out like I need to get this wig off it's already separating like right here at the side but like in the light it don't look like it don't look too bad I think I added too much place make us a round of green beans My husband's been getting us this Iceland water. Hmm. 
because he had like seen like a TikTok or something about like pH levels and water and what type of water is like good for you and what's not and all types of stuff. So, baby, he got us stocked up on Iceland water and it is so good. So we only drink Iceland. We used to drink Pure Life, but now we only drink Iceland, Icelandic. Is that what it's called? Icelandic and oh, what is this one? I don't know if it's the placebo effect or what, but I enjoy drinking this water so much more than I like drinking um, what other, whatever other water I be drinking, girl. The Pure Life, let me turn this light on. The Pure Life, I ain't got nothing on this. And the pH is 8.4, so is this acidic? I don't know. What was I about to do? Oh, let me go ahead and... I'm eating green beans now and oh my god green beans are so good the extra fine green beans from whole foods not whole foods from um costco oh my god i love it oh and tomorrow i'm going to the dermatologist finally i don't know why i've I, uh, been delaying it but i am going to the dermatologist so um I'm not excited. I'm a little bit nervous. I was looking for a black dermatologist because I don't know, like, with the issue that I'm having. I don't know if you can see. Like, it's peeling now. Like, the rash is, like, peeling and it's, like, mostly dried up. But I don't know. Hopefully, this lady knows, like, black skin. Because even when you look up rashes, like, you Google rashes or something like that, they always say stuff like, oh, you'll notice that the skin turns pink, like everybody white. <laughs> Girl, we got different skin tones. Some of us get hyperpigmentation, like my skin don't turn pink. She don't turn pink. So, not as many green beans. My husband has this, the veggies. So let me just do this. My sinuses are like acting up, oh, babe. I don't know what's going on. Wow, have y'all heard about them people? I wonder if they found them. I have any updates on those people. Oh, shit, let me look them up. Y'all, my ADD is out of control. What about them Titanic people? What happened with them? I should go on TikTok. Titan... Yeah, Titanic submarine. I have been... I went down um, a TikTok rabbit hole. Oh, they haven't found it. Oh my God. They haven't found it. Oh, I hope they find those people. Girl, that's crazy. I do not know. Like when I saw the submarine, I was like, I could never get in there. Cause it's like so tight. Like it's really, really like, like the claustrophobia. And he was like control. I don't know if he was like joking, but the guy said that he was controlling it with like a Logitech controller. Like, I'm like, that is crazy. Ooh, girl, I miss Flavin Hot Cheetos. I see it, Marie J. She put up a video and there's like some hot Cheetos in her picture. Oh, I couldn't hear hot Cheetos. There was one time I had on a waist trainer. <laughs> like, why the girl, I had on a waist trainer. Do I have dimples? Girl, not me going back. Girl, I got, girl, I got dimples. <laughs> I had on a waist trainer at work. I used to work at the, I used to be a receptionist at the Porsche Experience Center, but I worked on the corporate side of um, of Porsche. I was the receptionist for the corporate side. And I was sitting at the front desk, me and my homegirl and my coworker, homegirl and coworker. We were sitting at the front desk. And I was like, okay, I was eating hot flame hot Cheetos. I hadn't had flame hot Cheetos in a long, long, long time. So I, I was eating the flame hot Cheetos, girl. And I was just eating, I was enjoying myself. I was so happy. And out of nowhere, girl, I projectile, trigger warning, <laughs> girl, I just, not projectile, I ran to the bathroom and I threw up. I didn't feel anything in my stomach. My stomach felt fine. I just was like, what is going on? My husband doesn't like the carrots, nor do I. Um, so yeah, they put so many carrots in there too. I just, oof, girl, nothing but carrots. So I, um, yeah, girl, so I had to go home that day. I took off my waist trainer and girl, I was perfectly fine. And it was after that day, I said, girl, why are you wearing waist trainers? Like, what are you up to? Like, that don't make no sense that you're deciding that you want to wear a waist trainer. And eat flaming Hots. My acid reflux said, boop, boop. I ran to that bathroom and I was thinking like, oh my God. 
<laughs> am I pregnant? I sounded like y'all. Come <laughs> with me. Why the heck am I throwing up? Girl, it was always trigger. And the flaming hots, because flaming hots, like if I've always I've had acid reflux all my life. Um, but it just is aggravated by stress and the clothes that I wear. I never can wear tight clothes around my waist because it's gonna make me like you know what I'm saying? So I have to be careful. That's why I like one piece outfits because it's just easier to wear and if i'm sitting for a long time i won't get sick so we got the broccoli <laughs> now all i gotta do you said i'd be putting too much food on here and i feel like i just did that i probably should take a couple pieces of broccoli off let me he be hungry though after going to the gym so i don't i want to feed my man <laughs> y'all see my teeth i'm sorry my add is all over the place y'all see my teeth I think I'm on my last set of trays, I don't know. But my teeth are amazing. Now I'm supposed to be getting, I want to get bonding because a couple of my teeth are like too small. That's what my dentist said. Like the shape of them, it's like too small. So like you see, like uh, here, these teeth, are, they're really like children's teeth. Like they say it's not the size of adult's teeth. I'm supposed to be getting those like bigger and getting bonding on those teeth and bonding on the front teeth. So I can, um, because I have a chip right here from third grade from my best friend in third grade, her name was Tanisha. She, we were supposed to demonstrate a word like for our, our English class. So our teacher had said like the word massage and we were supposed to, out the word massage I was sitting at my desk and she was so excited she ran up behind me to massage me and she literally ran so fast that she pushed me into the desk and I bit my desk made a dent in the desk and chipped my tooth so since I rain my tooth has been chipped but you really can't you can't tell but it does like because it's like uneven my like I kind of lean to the side. I don't lean as much because I have Invisalign so it kind of straightens it out. So let's be getting my gums shaved. Like I have a little bit more dental work to do but I don't know, I like, I really like my teeth now. And I don't know, but I, I'm on my last trace to turn that tooth right here and that tooth's turned but this tooth I need it to turn. So when I get my bonding, I can get all one, two, three, four, five, I think six teeth. I'm gonna get my front six teeth bonded up so i don't know girl i guess i'm gonna figure out what i'm gonna do but either way child i'm gonna figure it out so yeah girl that's what's going on with me what's going on with you mm -hmm. y'all tell me down below <laughs> um Go ahead and put the veggies in that I have to put in his potatoes and then we're all good for dinner. Then I have to clean my office from the mess I just made. And then jump in the shower. We close out the day. Tomorrow I'm going to the dermatologist. I'm super nervous. I'm scared of what she's gonna tell me. I'm terrified. I'm terrified. But I'm not trying to do like veneers. They keep asking, like my dentist that I get my cleanings from, she was asking me if I want veneers and I was like, no. My mouth is way too small for me to get veneers. And veneers, sh shout out to the girls that have veneers. Veneers look insane to me. <laughs> they look crazy. And for some people they look great, like if your face fits it, but my face is like really small. So when I put, if I put veneers in my mouth, I'm gonna look like that man. That be like, around like this. I don't wanna do that. I'm gonna I'm go ahead and stick with my natural teeth. Okay. I'm gonna stick with my natural teeth and then I'm gonna um, just do bonding. And bonding is like really light. You can remove it, it doesn't um, mess up the integrity of your teeth. That's what I want. I wanna be able to remove it and be like, ah, I'm, I'm done with the. Pondy. Or I can say like, oh, I want veneers later, which I don't know if I'm ever want veneers. I don't know if I'm ever gonna want that. If you have veneers, like natural veneers, comment down below. But these procedures, it's too many people, too many dentists out there that are like online dentists that look good online, but in person, like you don't even know 
Like you can't even verify their work. And the people that I like to go to are the ones that don't have like a real online presence because I don't want you to be making my look like an online look. I want my look to be natural every day. People go to work and can have these teeth and nobody's looking like, why are her teeth so white? Like, ooh. Husband's some potatoes. Yeah. <clears throat> I know ran my mouth about a whole bunch of nothing. I don't even know what I talked about. Oh, as far as like figuring out my style, I'm trying to figure out like, I'm trying to figure out what my style is right now as a, at my age of 36. God, grab and say I'm 37, 36. I'm just trying to figure out what my style is. And like, I think so far I'm figuring it out, but I'm noticing I have to spend a little bit more money. Like I can't do fat. I went on Fashion Nova's website and I was like, oh girl. Ooh, I put too much oil on that. I went on Fashion Nova's website and I was like, girl, none of this stuff is appealing to me no more. And it's been like, I think how many years? Like maybe four or five years since I ordered from Fashion Nova. Because Fashion Nova, honey, they, um, they definitely, um, what was I gonna say? Fashion Nova, girl, they didn't used to send stuff on time. I think they have better shipping now. But at this point, I'm not, I'm tr I am try not to spend my money on fast fashion. I don't know if J-Lux label is fast fashion. I feel like it is, but I feel like this stuff is a little bit more quality. I don't know, but I just want to invest a little bit more in nice pieces. So that's why I've been going to Nordstrom and looking for stuff. But since I don't have like a set style yet, it's kind of hard for me to like, go in and say like, oh, I like this. I can see this, I can see it. Put it in a one piece, girl, or match up the stuff, okay? Please, so I know what to wear. This is what the living room looks like now with, I love this lamp. It's so pretty, it's so tall. Because our ceilings are so tall, we kinda needed a tall, um, we needed a tall lamp. And I didn't even know that this one was this tall, but it's perfect for high ceilings, like perfect for high ceilings. So I wish I had curtains because I feel like that would look cute, but I feel like this living room is kind of coming together. It looks better in the daylight. So maybe I'll show y'all in the daylight tomorrow, but it's such a cute vibe. And let me turn on this light. Where's my phone? Up over here. I need to put up the frozen veggies. Girl, I got the milk. <laughs> turn on the living room light. Look how cute. Ugh. Let me see. I've been liking purple for like a vibe when I'm like watching TV. Purple has just like been that color. So I've been like watching TV, just laying on the couch with a little purple lamp. It's so adorable. I love it. Love that lamp. So happy we got it. It was the last one at Target. And I'm so happy we got it. Um, I need to go ahead and take this wig off because it is dragging my head down and it's already kind of lifting at the side. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this wig off and it's tangling like crazy. So I'm gonna take this wig off. Um, no, I'll see you Friday for this. I think it's Friday when this video is coming out. Wait, what day? Wait, what else do I have to do? Girl, I'm so all over the place. Um... I think it is Friday. So I'll probably see y'all Friday with this wig review. It'll be this wig review, this Amazon wig review. So I'll see y'all Friday. <laughs> this hair is so much hair. Like, and it's tangled all up at the bottom. Like, I need to cut this. Anyways, I'll see you Friday with this wig review. Hopefully you enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching this vlog, participating, and just chatting with me. Um, Love you all. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.